Do you want to stay on the mountaintop with Jesus transfigured? This is Father John Hollowell, and this is a part of the Rise Up series. In today's gospel, we hear this wonderful story about how Jesus takes three of his apostles, Peter, James, and John, up the mountain, and then he's transfigured before them. And this is done for a couple of reasons. Uh, first of all, he wants them to see and know that he is really God and, and, and the Christ. And then, but what we see also in the apostles is that they want to stay there, right? Peter actually says, can we build three tents here? Uh, because he's just so full of bliss and, and wants to stay up there forever. But Jesus uh, reminds Peter and the other two disciples, apostles, as they're heading down the mountain, that the glory fades, obviously, and when, when Peter looks up. And so, again, Jesus reminds them on the way down uh, the mountain that, that he's, he's going to be having to die. So Jesus tells the three of them on the way down the mountain that they should keep it a secret until he has been risen from the dead. And then the, the three apostles are also then saying, like, what does he mean by rising from the dead? And so the, the apostles are always really slow to understand uh, throughout the Gospels until uh, the Holy Spirit actually comes upon them in the Acts of the Apostles. So again, I think it's just, do, do we believe that uh, Jesus is, has had to die, but also more importantly, that he rose again from the dead? And, and I think that that changes everything, obviously. It changes the whole universe. Uh, that God died, but also that God rose from the dead. And so again, there are some questions down below and I invite you to discuss those uh, with your group and God bless.